doing today, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Talon Master J here for week number eight of the BBL, our debut into Uber's League. As you guys know, last week we got our first win over Incog and his Boston Cyndaquils finally got a dub in BBL. Granted, we're out of the playoffs, not the end of the world. It happens, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, but in all fairness, I said it before, I'll maintain it till the day I die. I'm grateful as hell to Owen, grateful as hell to Matt, grateful as hell to Liv, grateful as hell to everybody in BBL. And you know, maybe when Sword and Shield come out, we'll get a shot again with them. But I think this is actually a first matchup, ladies and gentlemen. We're going after um, It's Whatever, or Antonio, I think is his real name. I'm not 100% sure on that one. Uh, but we're going up against him and his Sacramento Nito Kings. Uh, and again, in all fairness, I'm really looking forward to this. And he honestly brings to everything I thought. He brings the Pharaoh, brings the Blasef, he brings the Palkia. He, I mean, we know one thing's for sure because we did, uh, we took some notes and everything. Uh, the Zamazenta, we already know straight up. It's going to be crown form. It has to be. If it's anything else, it's not going to be. Blacephalon, I'm assuming it's got a uh, flamethrower and shadow ball and stuff like that. Probably specs, probably scarf. I'd be shocked if it was anything else. Uh, Palkia's done its own thing. Uh, Zara's had a couple of unique things. Ferrothorn, that's why we have protective pads on the Lucario, by the way, for that Ferrothorn. Get some uh, damage on it without getting uh, hit very hard. But I did say that my lead was going to be uh, Mamo. Get on my own rocks, even though I have a feeling he would try to get up his own rocks. But then again, I mean, Zamazenta does just destroy my team, if I'm, if I'm being fully honest right now. Uh... But yeah, good luck, have fun to Antonio. Good luck, have fun to the Nito Kings. And uh, based on the standings, I mean, he's semi remaining in the um, in the playoff picture. And in all fairness, I mean, he's based off of the Sacramento Kings. It's the closest the Kings are going to be getting to any uh, playoff anytime soon. As we see the Palkia as the lead that's unfortunate and it kind of throws us off our game right now because like if i pull up my mammo swine and i put up palkia level 50 it'll take me down and that's assuming it hits me with hydro pump or surf for that matter um so I think I'm going to have to switch into Lottie here, predicting the predicting the surf, and then we would know off rip what his set would be. I think that's what I'm going to have to do here. All right, he went for Surf. Lottie will go 150 down to 115. I will put Surf here. Surf did 52 points of health. So that's an almost max roll for Modest with Lustrous Orb. Uh, well, actually, let me let me do Choice Specs too. Or it could even be a low roll for Timid Specs. I think what I want to do is go for the Draco. If I if I drop it on something that it 
We'll know right now what the Palkia set is. He withdrew. Ferrothorn? Zamazenta, okay. Crunch Zama? And Draco. Uh, I mean, that did just about 25%. So that's a roll for no HP, no defense. Now here's a question. Now, does Zama get. I know it gets wild charge, if I'm not mistaken, right? What do you have that on the crown form? Because the crown form, no matter what, has to have Behemoth Bash. But what do you have Wild Charge on this thing? Um, I'm actually going to bait that he doesn't. I'm going to go for... Dark Aura comes out as he Behemoth bashes. Okay. This will do... Um... Behemoth bash, Rusted Shield. Wait a sec. Uh, I did 69 points of health. Which is... Um, I'm actually just going to say that he goes into Zara here. All oh, right, Zama's faster than. Oh, I should have went for the. This isn't gonna do anything. Um, I think I just got to sack off Lottie here. Because I, I, I need... Def oh, he withdrew into what? Falcon. Okay, hold on a second. on just a second here. That might have just helped us. Um, how much was Lottie doing with Mystical Fire? 33 to 40? Actually gonna, I'm going to try to drop a Draco again. And I should have went for the... Oh, Moltres. Okay, wait a second. This might do, like, absolutely nothing. And so... 
This thing has to be like... Um, I'm going to go into Dippin' Dots here. Yeah, he's got to have some, some special defense there. Because that did 45%. He's got to have, like, some special attack, some special defense. Maybe some HP. Alkia, okay. the freeze dry do i want to bait the switch into that blacephalon with a water pulse i mean it probably won't do anything fifty-seven to sixty-eight percent meanwhile freeze dry does twenty-five blizzard does thirty-nine um I'm gonna go for the freeze dry here. If he goes into Blossef, that's a good play. Oh, he stayed in. Should I think this KOs? Hello! Goodbye, Palkia. Now that's a free bring in for Izama. Nothing I have wants to take a hit from it. Yep, there's the blast stuff. Do I predict the flamethrower though? I'm gonna say, let me just double check. How much time do I have left? 447, Cephalon. I mean, if I get this prediction right, that's big for me and I get a hit on something. Um, and I'm gonna go into Soaring Eagle. I know right now if I made the prediction. Yes! Made the prediction. 100. Ooh, the burn. That's unfortunate. And I'm also faster. So that is definitely specs. This is definitely a specs placephalon. Um, he bring. I mean, he probably made the Moltres. And I'm gonna. I'm gonna say he switches. He withdrew into. There's a. Woo! Ooh, hello! Wait a second! It is an Aka Berry!
All right, now what do I want to do? Um, I think I keep body around. But I kind of also want to go for the KO here on, on something. I'm just going to click another Mystical Fire. Withdrew. Ultras, okay. Berserk does plus two, if I'm not mistaken, right? Critical hit. Or is it just one? Just one, okay. Hail stops. That's big. I'm going to drop a Draco here. If Lottie's going down, it's going to... It's either going to go down by itself or take Moltres down with it. Please take it down. Yes! I will take... I will take the sack. Lottie, thank you. Thank you very much. That's also an indirect kill for Blasef. All right, so now he's got Zara. He's got uh, Zama. He's got Blusseth, and he's got Ferrothorn. I'm gonna. Zero. Okay. Um, Necro. Zara. We go for knock here. Question. I feel like he would. I feel like that's the play for him, is to go not. And I kind of need Necro around for the... F well, no, I got... I'm going to go for a Photon here. Plasma Fist. This will do 34 at minimum if it's not banned. Um, that did... 70. Okay, that was about a roll for both of them. Um, and I'm actually about to go into Mastodon Zord. Predicting another Plasma Fists. Don Zord comes out. Plasma Fists. That's a good breed on our part. And I don't even think Ferrothorn likes an Earthquake against me. 31 to 37%. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna click Earthquake. Some, something's taking an Earthquake. So you see, okay, it's a zero. We survive. Although that did a lot more. Eject pack, okay. 
Uh, I was at 204. I think I went down to 32, if I'm not mistaken. I gotta double check. Barathorn comes out. We are fine with that. Thirty to two hundred four. Okay, that was a max roll for Adamant. We'll just sack off Mano here. Ooh, he sets up his own rocks. Well, that's on four. To an extent. I'm going to go into Lucario here. Because if I'm not mistaken, I did enough speed to outspeed every mon on his team. At plus two. We used agility. Is he going to set up another layer of spikes or something? Gyro ball. Ooh. Okay. Thank God for the resist. We'll just EQ. Because, yeah, I've got enough speed. I've got enough speed in this Lucario. It sh at least it shows. At plus two, I outspeed his entire team. Because the Blacephalon is not Scarf. It is Specs. I count the damage. Though I think I even planned for Scarf Blacephalon. I plan for Modest. Zama. And it says this does 61 to 78 percent. We're about to find out right now. And we get the KO here. If we get the KO, this is huge. combat oh we got a low roll we got a min roll no wait can we survive this i doubt it at minus one i doubt it we sir we live no way no way oh my god no way Okay, we're just EQing. We are EQing. Oh my god, that's huge. Oh, no way. Oh my god. Oh my god, did we just serve? Did we just. Oh my god.
Lasef comes out. We click EQ. Because we are fat. We should be faster. We are faster. Goodbye, Blacephalon. Oh my god, Lucario! Why did I have you on the team earlier? Juno! I told you you're my dog, man! I told you! Why did I have Juno on the team earlier? That Zara comes out. It takes that, the rocks chip. We just click EQ. And that is a 5 0 win, ladies and gentlemen. Woo -hoo -hoo! Oh my goodness. Oh my good gracious. Thank God for the agility, Lucario. Oh my god. I told you. I told y'all why I am a steel type master. I told you. I just motherfucking proved it, y'all. I just proved it once again. Oh boy. I mean, I'm not trying. I'm not trying to you know sound hype on that, but I've told y'all I'm a steel top master. I may be called Talon Master J because I'm a Falcons fan, and Talon Flame is one of my top Pokemon ever. But damn it, I know how to use them steel tops, baby. I know how to use them steel. Ah. Whew. Yo, don't come after me with steel types, y'all. It's gonna end badly for you. I'll just say it straight up. I am the Steel Type Master. Thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like down below. Sub if you're new. Let's get to one. Let you know what hell? If we get to 150, smash to 200. Let's get to two bills, ladies and gentlemen. After that kind of a battle, 150 is at least my main goal. But if we can push the two bills after that battle, I will take it, y'all. This is Talon Master J. And I'm flaming to the sky.